Tom, Rick, and Andrew truly will forever be a part of who we are. Honoring these three fallen heroes, today hundreds gathered to pay tribute to Rick Wheeler, Tom Bashevsky, and Andrew Zajac. As their friends and family mourn their loss, thousands more across the state will always remember them for the sacrifices that they made to keep us safe. Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Caitlin Reardon. A memorial was held for these fallen heroes today in Wenatchee, where hundreds came to pay their respects and say their final goodbyes. We aired that service today on KHQ. If you didn't get a chance to see it, here's a look back. A sad day across the state as we remember the three fallen heroes who gave their lives to keep us and our families safe. Today, hundreds gathered to remember the sacrifice that Tom Bashevsky, Andrew Zajac, and Richard Wheeler made. Hundreds of people poured into the Toyota Center in Wenatchee, the room filled with emotions of sorrow for the fallen men and joy in remembering the lives they led. Tom Bashevsky's parents spoke of how their son made such an impact on their lives. Before Tom was born, I thought it was parents that taught their children about life. But it didn't take many, very, very many days into Tom's life when I realized that I was actually going to learn from him. So Tom was the light of my life. And my path, I'm afraid, will always be a little bit darker because I'll miss him so much. One thing these three men had in common was their love of the outdoors and their passion for helping people. Rick Wheeler's friend, a fellow Forest Service firefighter, was able to speak on behalf of their family about the bond that they shared. The brotherhood that we have as wildland firefighters truly meant something to Wheeler. And I'm sure that someday we'll have those fears you and I had talked about. It's always a tragedy when a parent outlives their child. Speaking with a broken heart, Andrew Zajac's mother looked toward a brighter future. I am sure there will be beauty, there will be laughter, and there will be profound peace around one of the corners in this trail of life. To the firefighters in this room, you have my utmost respect. Rest in peace.